worldwide exclusive. All right, y'all. Good morning, afternoon, or evening, whenever you're tuning in. I'm grateful to have you here. And we got my man Keith G back in the building with a request from Patreon today. We got Creed again. He loves some Creed, and I do too. A Thousand Faces is the name of the song. We got a lyric video. Thank God for that. Uh, it's my 10th reaction to Creed, and I can't lie. I've loved every single track we've done up to this point. So hopefully that momentum continues today. But hey, if it's rocking and knocking, the banger shades will be on. If you're new, welcome again. Set that over here. Let's get it popping. I stand surrounded by the walls that once confined me, mm. knowing I'll be underneath them when they crumble. Like Astro Simmers dressed under my skin. Different smiles again. So much I hide. Oh. How we're stepping back a move forward. Oh. Now I'm forced to look behind. I'm forced to look at. Oh Lord, no, we're bringing that back. You're not gonna get away with with an inclusion like that. We got who was that? Scott was that? Mark was? Y'all let me know. We got Scott, Scott, Mark, and uh, who was the other one? And my bad, no disrespect, but I love this band. Creed is the truth. Oh man, that's heavy. Talking to himself. Guaranteed he's talking to himself. Putting up a front. A ton of them. We all do it. I'm alive. Thank God. Real or fake? How we're stepping back on the forward. Now I'm forced to look behind. I'm forced to look at you. You will not It's in the past, though. Leave it there. This is a bang. I all need it. Depends which day you catch me on. Depends which day, because I think what he's really saying is are you to take a step back or to take a step forward, you got to take a step back. You got to look at what you've been through, the things that you've done. But in reality, sometimes looking in your past, a lot of the times it's gonna depress you. You're gonna, you're gonna overcomplicate things and be like, hey, why why was I acting this way? Why was I putting up this wall and putting up this front acting like I, I was feeling a certain way when I wasn't? So those those faulty smiles, it, it was forced, but it wasn't real. Mm. Just just a little thought, just a little interpretation as we're about midway through. Go Y'all head, go ahead and let me know what you think so far in my comments if you don't already know what it's about. But I think he's the one wearing a thousand things. All of us have done it. Keith, you're making me think again. Tell me which is you. I like it though. That's what people need. Have to dive into that brain box. Y'all can tell I don't know what I'm doing. That's me up, Lord. I 
don't need that. Go ahead. I'm getting better day by day, letting out them things. Oh, I might need these back. Hold on. Now I'm forced to look behind. I'm forced to look at you. I love lyrics. I can act like I've been here. Their Full Circle album has to be one of the most prominent, prolific, outstanding ones to hit the streets ever. And I don't think Creed gets enough credit. I think they are way underhyped for all that they brought to the table and how they stayed true to their faith and always delivered. They didn't sell out. They knew what they believed in. They talked about it and they they let it out. Bottling that stuff up, bottling all those emotions, the hate, the the regret, the just anger that you have, bottling it up does nothing. So as I know we a lot of us get the tendency to put up walls and these fake facades and acting like things are all good when really you're getting deteriorated inside. You're getting absolutely bashed, belittled, and eating yourself up inside. But we're only here one time. You got to look in the past and, and see what you've been through. But I think it's, it's one of those things where this song, it has a lot to do with my own prison, the, the song that we checked out before. Y'all can see I'm uh, peripherating a little bit, uh, perspirating, my bad. My English grammar is all over the place, scatterbrain. That's Creed did a great job whenever they do that. My equilibrium can't think and put proper English words into context. That means they serve their purpose. So absolute banger. I had to take them off a couple times just to really see, was, was I really going through what I was going through and experiencing that track? But I think this this has to do with my own prison because, uh, which we also reviewed, he's stuck in his mind in his own prison. And, and in this song, he's looking back on the walls that he had to drop to get where he's at today. When you have to take a step back to go forward, he was questioning himself, but you got to. And the thousand faces is, is really him trying to find himself, which we've all been there, man, woman, black white whatever color creed don't matter we all bleed red one race human race we all got issues we're all sin we're all completely flawed in a beautiful way and that's why we need jesus christ who took on the cross for our sins but again we put up walls all the time because we don't want to feel vulnerable we don't want to feel exposed and, and people to see our sin to see our imperfections but i think that's what he meant by crumbling walls that crush him but you can't let it you got to let it out, man. Let it out. Be true to you. Be authentic. And I know it hurts. I know it's not easy, but you got to face that. You got to look in the mirror and say, you know what? Doing all this fake fronting is getting me nowhere. Let's be real. Let's try being you know, vulnerable for a minute. And that's how we progress. That's how we step forward and get over those fears, get over those obstacles and hurdles. There's always going to be some. Each, each opportunity you go through is something that you can grow through. God gives us all different cards for, for different reasons, but he serves it all together for the greater good. And y'all know I have to take it to scripture and dish out some biblical soul food, because if you're, if you're new to this channel, this is just how we get down over here. And as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. So today's sponsor is the Bible, the basic instructions before leaving earth. So let me take it to Romans 12 verse 2 for y'all hopefully you can relate if you want to leave leave roll out this may, may not be for you but I encourage you to listen because the Bible God is for everyone Jesus took on the cross for everyone you and I alike no matter how ugly and, and sinful you are hey I was a scumbag of a man I'm still imperfect we all are that's why we look to Jesus for salvation but Romans 12 2 do not be conformed to this world but be transformed by the renewal of your mind that by testing you may discern what is the will of God what is good and acceptable and perfect. Marinate on that for a second. Second Timothy one verse seven for God gave us a spirit, not of fear, but of power and love and self-control. 
Let that sink in. And then the last one I'm going to hit y'all with before you roll out and hopefully have a great blessed day because you are here. You can breathe in life. You're on the right side of the grass. First John 1 verse 9. If we confess, English please, if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. So there's no better words ever laid out on paper and you can call it fiction. You can call it fairy tale daddy whatever you would sky daddy whatever you want to call him god is real god made all of this wouldn't be possible without him jesus was real came down in in human form because we were filled with evil the world was filled with sin he said put it on me i'm perfect i got this i feel bad for them but they don't know any better so jesus took it on why wouldn't you look to that that is the the best most humbling perfect story ever in humanity for all eternity never will be a better one so look to that good book i'm telling you if you're lost trying to create your own path there's already been one laid for you there's only one rock there's only one foundation you can find that in jesus christ the messiah the king yahweh come on now but hey i love y'all y'all comment comment your thoughts below you can agree disagree we can still be civil still be respectful whether you're religious non-religious whether you have that relationship with the lord or not i know people get upset when i say religion it's a relationship really but for for people that don't know god for people that don't know christianity and and the value of the bible sometimes you, you use terms that you know you know you know more about in context than the average man or woman that's just it, we call it religion but really once you get into it and once you're serious and that's how you base your life it's a relationship but again you may disagree down below let me know why outside of that like subscribe hit that notification bell so you can stay up to date on all my videos uh share this video whether you agree disagree at least for creed for great music share that uh shout out to my brother keith g again for making me think and another absolute banger of a track to check out i encourage y'all to go stream this download it put it on the playlist whichever one it really don't matter this is a vibe and a half all across the board but outside of that if you want to get some gibby gear that's linked down below all the products i use and stand by brands that support me are linked in my description section but until next time i love y'all i'll be praying for you if you need to reach out devin at devgibson.com godspeed i'm gone